All right, what's going on guys, your boy Flex Daddy Dynamite here, back with another video. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to properly install the Glorious Model Low software. First thing you guys want to do is get to this page right here, the Model Low software page. I'm going to leave a link to the page in the description down below. And so once you guys get here, you want to scroll down to where it says software. You want to click on the one that says download Model Low and Model Low minus software. I already installed it, so I'm not going to click it. Once you do that, and you click on open it, this should pop up. You want to click on firmware, and then you want to click on glorious model at the bottom one right here. Double click that, and it's gonna it's gonna say burn. You're gonna wait for that to finish. I already did it, so I'm not gonna do it again. Once you once this finish um loading, you want to go back to the folder. Double click the folder. Go back to the main menu, and you want to double click on software. Then double click on glorious software. And then you want to click yes, and it should be it should be on the the setup wizard now. So if you made it to the setup wizard, that means you did it correctly. P select whatever folder you want it in. I'm just gonna leave it default. And then you click install, and you should be good. Run glorious model software. Finish, and it should pop up the software now. There it is, boys. All right, over here is where you sign your buttons. You don't want to leave your one and two the same. Your left click, your right click. You can change your scroll wheel. The two buttons on the side, the four and the five. You can change uh, the DPI loop to something else if you want. And over for the DPI settings, these are color based. So if you click your DPI button, it's going to switch to one of these colors. It's going to change the speed as well. So if you see blue on the bottom of your mouse, that means you have an 800 DPI. So I'm going to click the button right now. Now it changes to this. Click it again. Changes to that. And you can just switch the colors that you want so you know what DPI you're using. You can also switch the sensitivity of the DPI. Just mess around with this if you want. <laughs> and for the light and for the light in, I'm going to show you guys what the lighting looks like. It looks like at the end, so stay tuned for that. The mouse parameter I recommend you leave this the same. The pollen rate and stuff. Unless you're an advanced mouse user, I recommend you just leave it the same. It's good where it's at. And you could change the different profiles. So if you want like a, a DPI that has 600, 9,000, 500, 3,000 DPI, and you want another profile that has a different DPI, you could just change it and switch between profiles. If you want to change your DPIs and your settings. If you're playing Fortnite, and your Fortnite settings are different from your PUBG settings. This is what the profiles are used for. And now I'm about to show you guys what the lighting looks like. Alright, this is the glorious mode effect at one speed. We're going to turn up to two speeds, see how it looks. It's kind of faster. Change it to three speeds. Not much better. We're going to leave it like that for now. You could also change the direction of which, which you want it to go from up to down or from down to up. Doesn't really make a difference for the glorious mode. We're gonna change the effect now. Change it to the seamless breathing RBG. Just gonna be switching between colors seamless, sleeve, seamlessly, seamlessly. Switch between colors. Change the next mode. This is the regular breathing. It takes a bit longer to switch colors. That's the only major difference. You could also switch the um pick the color that you want to switch through. Then we're gonna go down to single color. You only get one. You only can have one color. It's basically like a static color. You could change it right here. Click on that. You could change it to pink. Click OK. Now it's purple. And yeah, that's a single color effect. We're gonna scroll down to the breathing single color. It's the same thing. It's just gonna be breathing in. Oh. Just going to be going from light red to dark red. You can also change the color of that and the speed. Now we're going to be moving down to the tail effect. It's probably my favorite one. Just like goes through like that. You can change the brightness and you can change the speed. Try 3 speed 50 brightness. It's not that bad. Favorite so far is going to be the tail effect. You're going to go to rave. Select the two colors, the speed. This is what Rave looks like. Currently, you have red and blue. Change it to max speed. And yeah, shit is fucking crazy. This is max speed. Now we're gonna go down to 
wave. Turn it up to max speed and see how it looks. It doesn't look that good on max. Turn it to one speed. That's much better, I guess. This is kind of like the glorious mode, but much sloppier. So I wouldn't recommend using this. It looks shit. And for the last one, LED off. No fucking LED. It's pretty boring, as you can see. So my favorite one is going to have to be the tail. I don't know why. I'm just I'm fucking with the tail for now. And my second favorite one, uh, the seamlessly breathing. This one's pretty nice. If, you, if you're playing in the dark, it looks pretty cool as well. Just turn the light off. Yeah, the effects are not bad. I'm just gonna run through them, run through the effects with dark lighting. And there it is, boys. This is the glorious mouse. Ma mouse. Moose. What? This is the glorious mouse. Model O. Not bad at all. The LEDs are pretty cute. Yeah, this is my first time doing a, a fucking mouse setup review. Reveal. I don't know how I'm doing. I'm probably doing shit right now. But if you guys do enjoy, smash that like button. It's been your boy, Fact Daddy Dynamite. Peace out. Glorious model overview slash setup.